What's up guys, it's Willis at the 10 Hit Kit, your favorite adventure nerd. Today we're back here at the Three Brothers property and we're about to uh, start a project that I've been wanting to do down at the spring area. But at the moment we're gonna go search through the scrap pile and see what we can find for it. We'll take you down in the woods with us and we'll see when we get there and I'll give you the plans down there. But let's get into this video and start searching through the scrap pile. All right guys, here we go. I think we got enough stuff to do a little mock-up for now. I'm gonna go ahead and strap it to the top of the truck and then we'll drive on down in the woods and bring you guys along with us. We appreciate you checking this out. I said that all the time, but I really do appreciate it. We're having a great response on this channel. 228 people now following. So, woo, yay. Here we go, let's keep on moving. <laughs> oh man that was fun about ripped my arm off <laughs> oh man <laughs> oh that was fucking hilarious all right here we go again We made it it's much easier to see back in there these days now that the leaves are all off it'll be much easier to work back here plus the ticks are much less this time of year i'll give you a little shot Ooh, clean this can't clean this camera off dude You can definitely see the valley much more clearly. Kind of where everything runs through. Previous owners put a lot of rock up so that the ground wouldn't wash out too much. There's an old well house right here. You can see the foundation of it. They would have built it here. And I think maybe they had a couple more or maybe it tumbled down because it would have all been built out of rock and probably just washed all out probably what all the rock is down here. Old car parts. Old fender. Old back corner. And so it's much more cleared out. So we can see more. Uh, let me explain to you what we're going to do. There's a tree down here and we're going to take all this uh, scrap we're gonna bring it down here we're gonna to try to build a platform uh that goes from the hill to one of these logs that are down and we'll bring you along with us say it again but uh stay tuned and we'll, uh, we'll see you out there let's get out there let's have some fun guys okay we made it on up here this is my plan just to make a uh platform right here if i break this off scoot this forward I'll put that up. Anyways, we will build a platform right here just to have a place to hang out while we're down here. Uh, someplace that's flat because it's right in the middle of a valley. 
so there's really no place flat to sit um, and it's just something fun that I was wanting to do so uh, let's go ahead and uh, throw it the rest of the way together it's already kind of prefabbed because <laughs> I just brought stuff from the junk pile so uh, here we go let's keep going Here it is, it's not nailed down, it's not pretty, but it works. So we got ourselves a nice flat spot up here now where we can relax. Yeah, it works very well. You could probably even sleep up here pretty easily. Oh yeah, uh-oh, the water's leaking. That was fun. <laughs> Bust it open. All right. Let me clean this up and figure this out. Man, my platform's all wet now. Now we're going to sleep. It's actually pretty relaxing down here now. I think we got some longer boards. We do have some uh, old metal framing up there too. That might reach this span a little bit better. Span? Span? might reach this span a little bit better and then more more wood up there and we can put more top on it but this is a great start for me and we'll get back to you in a little bit here we go I'll quit rambling at you guys and we'll get back into it whatever it may be Welcome to platform nine and three quarters, where all your magical needs and desires come true. Hey, what's up guys? We uh, went ahead, we got our mock-up for our platform done. We're calling this place platform nine and three quarters. If you don't know, it's a Harry Potter reference. Uh, we got our, our hammock strung up there, up on, the, up on the hill. Give you a little shot of that. The whole, this whole place is gonna come together nicely. Uh, I'll come down here with the machete and start clearing out some of this underbrush. That way I can have a clear path to where my hammock will hang. And then if I have another friend out here, he can hang his hammock from any number of those trees. And we kind of have a triangle coming from this tree up the hill and that tree up the hill. And then there's other trees everywhere, obviously. But uh. This is just a mock-up. I know it looks like trash. It, it's because it is, it's refuge. We got it out of the trash pile. So, or the scrap yard, the scrap pile, whatever you wanna call it. But that's how we've been doing most of these projects. So, welcome to the hobo platform. One day we'll get this big enough and we'll probably pitch a tent on there and it'll be for our platform tent. Genius. Now it's merely a place to hang out, flat, nice solid spot. Um, it's pretty wet down in here, so it'll, it'll probably start to decay pretty quick. It's already been sitting up there in the elements, so who knows? I think we're going to get into some lunch. We got some Cajun-style andouille sausage and some big long peppers. Get those andouille sausages inside of the peppers, and then we'll cook it all together. So all that juice and that goodness, mm, it'll juices from the pepper and the juices from the sausage will all get into each other, and it'll all amalgamate and make one tasty bite it'll be it's gonna be so good i've had this idea to build this hobo platform for a long time so welcome to platform nine and three quarters all right we got our little fire area prepared now we're gonna go find some rocks to make a good little uh, fire ring. Start some lunch, because I need to feed the dad bod. But um bum Go find some rocks that aren't in the uh, valley, because all the water washes down through here and gets the rocks wet. You don't want one of these rocks exploding on you. I think the best move, try to find rocks without moss on it, because moss would 
indicate to me that it's probably moisture inside the rock. Could be wrong. But let's get to it. That's like a knife. <laughs> Busted out the side. Man, this place is really coming together. Um, the platform nine and three quarters. Uh, it's the hobo platform, whatever you want to call it. It's going to be a platform, camping platform, platform tent, you know, however we work it. Maybe just a hangout spot. And we'll sleep in our hammocks like you see here. This spot is pretty nice. I like the spring. It's got constant flowing water down here. Right there, you can see it, it comes out from the tree right there and comes out from over there. So we got spring water constantly coming out right here. And if we could build this place up and make it even uh, more usable than it currently is, I, I would be ecstatic. So throughout this uh, fall, winter season, I'll try to come down here and clean it up, cut out some of this underbrush, just so whenever it starts to leaf back up, because it, it's pretty thick as far as the unbrush goes. So I'll come through and clear all this out, at least clear this spot out. So we got a place to sit there. Um, but slowly but surely, we'll definitely get this thing put together and working a little bit better than it currently is. Just like the hobo lean-to that we got the fireplace into. I might go check it out before we leave. I'm going to eat some lunch and take a little hangout in, in the hammock. It's your favorite adventure nerd. We appreciate you checking out these edits. Let's get out there, let's have some fun.
pretty pretty decent spot we got here. Uh, platform nine and three quarters. Pretty fun. Shout out to at Pro Mix Sports Colorado over on TikTok and Instagram. Go check out their homie 7PL Customs as well. Give them a shout. You can find them on the internet. They'll get you hooked up with hats. They have apparel and sports swag. Check them out. If you're into hats, go check them out. If you got family, give them a call. I like promoting friends. I've been uh, rocking the Pro Image hats since since my friend started up uh, his own Pro Image. I just support, super loyal to my friends and my family. So go ahead and go check them out and they'll get you hooked up. See back there the platform. See where the fire was. Pretty good little spot. Time to clean up though. Time to get up and get motivated. It was nice to be out here out in the woods and be able to still do your work. So that's lovely. Here we go. Gonna close clean up the spot and head back into town and wait for the kiddo. And then Thursday night, nerd night. Got your hunting oranges on so you don't get shot in the face. I swear I heard deer and stuff trampling all around me. <laughs> At one point I even yelled out, hey, don't shoot me, I'm a human. I am not a deer. <laughs> deer season's almost over, but I think doe season starts up weekend so we'll see we got some people that probably come out and hunt that Here's the rest of our food mm. pretty good Cajun andouille sausage on a and stick peppers killed it Um, legit. See the car now that all the weeds are off the trees. Come out here and see if you can see down into the creek where the spring comes out. Spring comes out from underneath that tree right there. Runs down, you can see a first little pool right there. Runs on down, and now you can see from up here, there's like a pond, a swampy area in there, back in there. The guy tried to build a couple ponds, and they just kept getting washed out, apparently. Welcome to platform nine and three quarters. All cleaned up. It's a nice little mock-up of the platform. Uh, we'll bring out some more stout pieces of wood and do it right. We'll just con continue to build onto this and beef it up. Much like the hobo lean-to, we have built it up, you know, over time. So we'll probably do the same thing down here. I really like this spot, so probably continue using it. What it kind of looks like as I'm walking through here kind of made a little bit of a path broke down some of these sticks what kind of tree is this let me know in the comments below uh i don't really know my sister told me one time or my brother told me i can't remember who told me what it is but this is good for fire making 
So, anyways, if you know the name of this, with the, it's like shedding bark all the way up. Let me know what this kind of tree is. I don't, I have no clue. Write in the comment section below. Oh, the old hobo lean to. Had to come down to check it out. Man, what a cool little spot. Had to come down and check it out before I hit the road. It's just a cool spot. This has been my new way in. Because there's kind of a trail of hard stuff right here. It's Willis at the 10 Hit Kid, your favorite adventure nerd. Thanks for checking out this edit. We appreciate you watching these, getting those subscribers up. I'll keep making them if you keep watching them. But this is where we're going to end it officially. And we'll see you on the next one. Peace.